What is up everybody, Ben Johnson here, and today I am super excited because we're gonna be taking a look at B-roll and how to use it in your videos. All right, welcome back to the channel. As mentioned before, my name is Ben Johnson and I am a content creator based here in Atlanta. My goal with this channel is to be a resource to creatives through reviews, tutorials, behind the scenes content, and honest podcasts. If any of that interests you, I'd love to invite you to subscribe and join the creative crew. It really goes a long way towards supporting this channel and it makes sure that you never miss out. Now, let's talk about B-roll. B-roll is extra footage that you capture used to help enhance your storytelling ability with your video. This shot that you're seeing right here, right now, is known as A-roll. And typically, that is what's used to convey the actual story or message. Usually, it's a talking head shot like this or an interview style shot. B-roll clips are placed on top of A-roll clips while editing, and they're typically used to help enhance whatever the A-roll clips are saying. So in today's video, I'm actually going to use this nifty little light as an example. This light was sent to me by a company called Pixel and it's actually a pretty cool light. So I just wanted to showcase it a little bit on today's video. The first thing I do when creating B-roll is actually refer to my script. When making these types of YouTube videos, I highly recommend creating a script. It's super handy to do because then you know exactly what you wanna talk about before you ever hit record. It will make sure that you don't accidentally leave something out and it will help you stay on track. In today's script about the light, there are three things that I wanna cover. One, it's portable. Two, it's adjustable. And three, it's colorful. So first things first, let's go record some a -roll. This light is awesome because of how small and portable it is. It's very easy to take with me on shoots. It is also very adjustable from the brightness to the color temperature. You can really dial in the look that you want. And to top it all off, it has full RGB color options. All in all, this is an awesome piece of lighting equipment. Okay, so now that the A roll is captured, we're going to get B roll of each of the things that I've mentioned. While I'm talking about portability, I thought it would be cool to show off the light fitting into a backpack. So let's get that. While talking about how adjustable it is, I thought we could actually show me adjusting the light. I'm gonna go ahead and set up an object with the light next to it and film me just changing the brightness a little bit, maybe even the color temperature. For the A-roll where I'm talking about how colorful the light is, I thought we could complement that by showcasing a nice shot of the front of the light changing color. I may even wanna add in me adjusting the back of it so you can see a little bit of the controls. Now let's take a look at our A-roll one more time. This light is awesome because of how small and portable it is. It's very easy to take with me on shoots. It is also very adjustable from the brightness to the color temperature. You can really dial in the look that you want. And to top it all off, it has full RGB color options. All in all, this is an awesome piece of lighting equipment. Now let's place the B-roll clips on top. And let's see the final version. This light is awesome because of how small and portable it is. It's very easy to take with me on shoots. It is also very adjustable from the brightness to the color temperature. You can really dial in the look that you want. And to top it all off, it has full RGB color options. All in all, this is an awesome piece of lighting equipment. It's absolutely crazy how effective and dynamic this is in helping tell the story. I would highly recommend using B-roll in your next video. All right, guys, that is going to about wrap up this video. I hope that you have enjoyed this and found some value from it. Before you guys leave, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications, and as always, stay creative. Peace.